My name is Ksenia Sado. I am a graduate student in electrical and computer engineering here at NC State, and I am the current president of the NC State Contra Club. How long have I been dancing? Um, probably about five years. I started with contra dancing, so um, it's it's been quite a journey. I also do a lot of swing dancing, so I've been doing that for about two years, and that's been fun also, but it, it's very different from contra, I think. So. What got me into contra dancing? Well, originally it was friends uh, from college. Um, they found out about this club here on campus and, and dragged me along, and it turned out to be really awesome experience. It's funny because um, when before I came to the first contra dance, I could have told you that I would never dance again in my life. <laughs> um, I was pretty, you know, adamant about it, um, but they, they forced me to come along and it was the best decision ever. <laughs> so I would say Contra is a mix of ballroom dancing and line dancing. I usually tell people that it's very informal. I put the ballroom dance part of that in because I want people to realize that um, you do dance in pairs with a partner, you do a lot of twirling, a lot of spinning, so I kind of want that image to be anchored in their mind when they think of it. But at the same time, it is more like line dancing or square dancing where you're dancing with other people and you formation and you get to interact with lots of different dancers um, in a single song so yeah when people ask me what is contra I I'm in shock I'm like what you've never heard of this before <laughs> no no I, I realize that a lot of people have never heard of contra it's kind of a niche dance style but I try to explain to them what it is and, and invite them out to have dances because they're always so much fun and so accessible to beginners which is which is one of the main I guess beauties of Contra. I do love dancing and I do love music um, but my favorite thing is uh, the community that we have here um, at NC State and, and also in the Triangle. Um, I always get to meet new people but I also get to hang out with old friends and that that is the best feeling. Everybody's always really nice um, and they just Everybody's so diverse, but we come together and we do this quirky thing together, and it's it's a great time. <laughs> Absolutely, I would recommend Contra. It's a fun thing to do, and I have dragged all of my family and friends. <laughs> so far, I've been fortunate that people have liked it and, and come back and uh, talked about it. So, yeah, it's, it's been good. <laughs> what tips would I give to Contra dancers? To beginners, I guess, people who have never been. Um, Number one would be wear comfortable shoes. <laughs> it's it's a lot of dancing, it's very active, um, it's a lot of fun, but you're definitely going to use your feet, so wear something you can, you can stay in for a long time. And the other advice I would give is come with an open mind, because um, you're going to see interesting things, lots of interesting styles, you're going to see interesting people, um, and it's good to be open-minded about all that stuff because you're going to learn a lot more this way. So.